Welcome back to another episode. So today we are going to be targeting some rockfish from the kayak. I got a little something special. We're going to be cooking our fish today with one of my favorite chips. I'm going to be fishing alongside Luis Sanchez. Uh, we did uh, first time fishing together uh, our, on our last adventure for rockfish from shore. So today we're going to be fishing together from the kayak. Luis is right there about to launch. I think we got a good 20 minute paddle out to get to our spot and we got some pretty foggy conditions hopefully this fog clears up so we made it to kind of the spot i wanted to get to where we're in a ton of uh kelp and i'm not gonna be able to get to that shot of like facing me because my thing is all rusted in and i can't get that screwing done so we're gonna get that chest view as if we're like fishing from shore we got some artificial squid with some bait and we're just gonna troll the edges of all this kelp right here Ooh, there's a bite. Yep. Ooh. Little rockfish. It's a cool little rockfish. A little too small. Nice. What'd you get? Oh, really? Bro, that's a good one. Hell yeah. Let's go, boy. Yes, sir. Damn. First one on the yet. Shoot, Let's dude. That's legal, bro. Here. Yeah, here. You think? That looks legal. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> there. What was it? I got you. Yeah. Bro, that's a legal link cod. Yeah, it has to be 18. 22. Oh, I don't think so. Ooh. Ooh. What is it at? 22. 22. Check it out. Yes, yeah, a little past 22. I'd say 22 and a quarter. Yes, sir. Yeah, got him. A big hammer. Yes, sir. Yes, Things sir. Like, uh, five inch. Oh, that bait was has gone. Really? Oh shoot! Never mind. Hey, hey. Yeah. Oh, it's a bunch of uh, smell. Do you have your link on in the water? Huh? You have your link on in the water? Yeah. All right, just be be be, be aware. There's a seal right here. You don't want it snatching you and flipping you over. Yep. Oh, dude. Oh, this is a good one. Oh, dude. I don't know. No? Brown? That's a big one. Oh, dang. Man, this one hit hard. No, I was just letting it sit in the rod holder. Dang. That is a massive rockfish. Massive brown. on the chase bait let's go my gopro ran out of battery and i left the rest of my batteries back in the truck whoa but i got a shark Woo! gosh i thought this was a white sea bass or a big old link cod yes sir yes sir Woo. I caught Papa Leroy to see whether these are good to eat or not. But um, I called him up and he said that uh, people eat them in England. And, uh, you know, if you're going to keep and eat these to gut them and uh, bleed them out. But we're going to release this guy. Oh, he's super strong. Oh! <laughs> she almost bites you? <laughs> he tried. 
<laughs> that was cool. That was cool. That was my second one of the day. We came to this spot and something hit hit my squid really hard. Um, then it came off, reeling it halfway up, and then I dropped it right back down, hit again. Kate brought it halfway up, um, and then it came off again. And then the third time we got him. So third time's the charm. Caught a little little rock. Oh, that's it. Today we're gonna be cooking the fish that we caught with one of my favorite chips, and that chip would be Cool Ranch Doritos. We're gonna crush them up. Kinda got it into like a a panko vibe right there. So we're gonna cook this up like as we would with panko crumbs. We're going to, I have a egg and I'm gonna crack that eggling into a Ziploc bag. We're gonna make, make sure that our fish is coated all in egg. We're gonna take that fish, put it in our Doritos, our little small bag of Doritos, shake it up, get it all nice and coated, and then fry it. We're gonna add some olive oil. By the way, we are tailgating right now and cooking on top of my kayak, actually. So I got the kayak right there, <laughs> and I got this on top of that. I found a little little area where we got a nice view. We got our egg. I'm gonna give this a little mash. I cut one of the fillets up into three different sections and we'll add our fillets up in there. Make sure they're all nice and coated. We'll take our fish. One, two, three. We're gonna give this a nice shaking. And now it's all nice and coated. So we're gonna let these cool down just for a bit. They look really nice. It looks like, uh, this one looks like a little chicken wing. Uh, the one on the end got a little overcooked, but other than that, the taste test. Let me know what you guys think. I'll let you guys know what I think. The little baby chicken wing first. It almost tastes like fried chicken. You don't get that cool ranch Dorito taste. You get a nice crunchiness. Like you barely like you barely get a Dorito taste at all. Hmm. Maybe frying it took away that cool ranch flavor because I I barely get the a hint of the cool ranch. I feel like I'm eating fish that has a plain Dorito. It's like basically a tortilla chip. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed. Let me know what you guys think of this video. Maybe we'll try some other different trips. Maybe like Cheetos. Maybe probably not hot Cheetos because I don't like hot Cheetos. Funyuns. The nacho cheese Dorito. Let me know what y'all think and let me know if you want to see one of your favorite chips being cooked with some fish. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Thank you all for watching and until next time, keep fishing on. Peace.